Shakti. Let's now join Mariam Zakari for details. Declaring open a two-day national summit on justice organized by the Federal Ministry of Justice in collaboration with the Nigerian Bar Association and the National Judicial Council. President Bola Tinubu, who was represented by Vice President Senator Kashim Shatima, said the administration has embarked upon far-reaching reforms to enhance justice delivery, including the appointment of the full complement of the justices of the Supreme Court. However, despite progress being made in different institutions and agencies within the sector, the reality is that there is an urgent need for a functional justice system capable of supporting a rapidly growing economy, guaranteeing basic human and political rights of individuals, and providing security and justice to all. This makes continuing reforms imperative. It further underlines the need for the establishment of reliable metrics and benchmarks across all justice sector institutions in order to identify needed system changes and evaluate the effects of reform measures. Justice sector leaders and professionals need to find the right responses to the challenges we face through policy innovation, citizen-centered reform, system change, and legislative reform where necessary. I accordingly urge the leadership of all justice sector institutions to seek a new direction and focus on outcomes by creating a justice system that fully responds to the needs of our citizens. One, that serves Nigerians now and for generations to come. The President of the Senate, Senator Godsby Lakpabio, said the collaborative efforts of stakeholders will shape the strategic direction of Nigeria's justice system, making it more robust, accessible and equitable. According to him, the National Assembly will in the coming months deliberate on the proposals with the gravity and diligence it deserves. These delays harm our society's most vulnerable and create an environment where justice is seen as inaccessible and inefficient. In an era where technology has transformed so many sectors, it is critical that we harness our potential within our judicial processes to enhance speed and transparency. Senator Akpabio called on all stakeholders and state governments to support the reform towards actualizing a seamless justice delivery system. As part of the reform, he suggested that interlocutory appeals should come after adjudication on a substantive matter to save unnecessary delay in justice dispensation. In addressing specific reforms in the justice sector, we want to re-emphasize some key vital areas that are worrisome and incidentally most Nigerians seek reforms on them. It is essential that we reform our approach to interlocutory appeals in our civil cases. Currently, these appeals often cause unnecessary delays, prolonging litigation and burdening our, our courts. As was done in the criminal jurisprudence during the enhancement of during the enactment of Administration of Criminal Justice Act 2015, we propose that all appeals in civil cases should be taken only after the conclusion of the substantive matters. In his welcome address, the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Prince Latif Fagwemi, SAN, said the National Summit seeks to address critical challenges in the justice sector. As deliberations continue in this summit, I am optimistic that the knowledge and experience that you will share with us will assist in the resolution of the identified critical issues. Other stakeholders who presented papers at the summit included the Chief Justice of Nigeria, Justice Kayodi Ariwala, and the President of the Nigerian Bar Association, NBA, Mr. Yakubu Mekau, SAN, among others. Mariam Zakari, ADBN News.